Here's how you can do this insane transition using just your phone. Change your camera settings to 4K and get a shot of you walking towards the camera and then repeat this action in a second outfit. Import the clips into CapCut. Go to the point where you want the slow motion to start. Tap split, tap speed, and change it to 0.4. Do the same on the second clip. Deselect all the clips. Go to effects, then body effects. Tap apparate two. Add this effect over both of the slow motion clips. I slowed the effect speed down to 80%. Now change your settings to 4K and export the video. Import the video into a new project. Tap split and separate the clips. Tap overlay to drop it down a layer. I'll slide the clip to the left. Turn the opacity down to 50 to line up the timing. Turn the opacity back to 100. Go to the end of the transition. Tap mask. Choose split and invert the mask. Move it to the top of the frame. Add a little bit of feather to smooth. Now set a keyframe. Go back to the beginning of the effect. Move the mask to the bottom. This will automatically set a keyframe and your transition is done. You can stop here or for an added effect. Export the video in 4K again. Import the video into a new project. Add a keyframe at the beginning and scale into the footage using your fingers. Go to the end and scale back out. Import the fire clip. Tap blend and choose filter. Tap adjust and boost the brightness and contrast. Take down the saturation to make it white. Go to the middle of the transition, scale and position it over your body. Add a rectangle mask to shrink it way down, making it a little bit thicker than your transition line. Add some feather for smoothing. Set a keyframe, then scrolling along the timeline, reposition the fire layer so that it follows the transition line. And there you go. Should look something like this. Radio, that's a